Peace, yeah, it's your brother man from the motherland coming to you guys live from the NY. Real quick, brand new episode out right now. Title: The Regentrification is the Eradication of the Black Civil Civilization. Excuse me. Out right now, you can watch it on YouTube. Link in the bio. You can listen to it on the podcast audio. Link in the bio. Tune in, support. You know, raise the awareness for the people. You know, everything I do is for the people and the people only. Right now, with that out the way, let's have this conversation. This conversation is going directly to my sisters, the social media ones, the social media lovers, the ones that desire attention, that you know think there's nothing wrong with showing a little cleavage and you know being a sex object, a sex symbol, whatever you want to call it. Right? This is for you. This sister right here, her name is Cabana Lust. She is the original IG model. She is the epitome of a sex symbol when it came to social media. You find her on World Star, you'll find her on everything. Now, as you guys can see, you see the before and you see the after, right? Before, beautiful. After, destructive. Looks lost. Now, why am I saying this? Why am I bringing this forth? See. I want my sisters to understand something. You see, this world that you want to entertain in, that you want to be a part of, this social media um, meta universe nonsense that you want to be a part of, that you want to show your body and look good. Let me tell you what's going to happen. See, this woman was around the mall. Celebrities, videos, making money. She even dabbled in adult in adult films. And you see what God did to her. You see, when the Bible says my people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge, see, when you don't have knowledge, you end up being destroyed and you end up looking like that. You went from looking like this to like that. And a lot of you women are already looking like this, but got the money to maintain to stay looking like this. The reason why I'm saying this is it's time for my sisters. To start valuating yourself as queens, desiring a king, being a submissive woman to a righteous man, to a just man, to a warrior, to a fighter, to a soul survivor. You understand me? While you out here chasing this bag, seeking attention like she did when she was looking like this, she was around them all. She was around all the entertainers. She was around all, she was in all the clubs. She was getting all the attention. She was getting everything. Trips, flying here and there. Now look where they did with her. Look at the before and look at the after. Now ask yourself, mama, is that what you want? You want to look like this? You want to look like this? You want your children to see you like this? You want the world to remember you like this? Because you so focused on trying to be this, you forgot that all it takes is just one bad situation to end up like this. All it takes is for you women to lose your sponsor. Now, I'm not talking about just a man taking care of you, your sponsor, your job, your business. All it takes is just one situation to end up like this. See, the reason why... The reason why women are in this mentality Because Satan has made y'all believe That y'all can't do it on your own And no woman can do it on their own You need a male support And when you don't have that male support You're going to end up like this And if you're receiving male support Outside of a man How is it? Government assistance Huh? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten different dudes you're dealing with Four baby daddies all on child support this is what this is what's sustaining and keeping you looking like this when well, you should just be a submissive wife and the husband that he if he loves you he would never allow you to look like that see you don't see that you don't understand that you know why you don't understand that because you have been sucked into the www remember the wwf you've been sucked into the world wide web nothing is real these things is fake Money can't give you happiness. Fame won't give you fat happiness. Being in people's faces and receiving a thousand likes, going overseas to get your body done so you can look like this, so you can get attention, ain't gonna bring you happiness. 
Because God ain't never made woman to be nothing more than a helpmate. Okay? Your job as a woman, as a queen, is to make sure your king rules. And if he's not ruling, your job is to make sure you do the necessary things to put himself in position to rule. See, we are in captivity. America is not our home. America is what you call prison. Okay? We was taken from some place and brought here in servitude. And just because they set you free physically, doesn't mean they don't got control over you spiritually, mentally. Okay? You control the mind, you control the spine. All right? And they have control our minds. This is why they have us walking wherever they want us to walk. Acting however they want us to act. Having women desiring to be this. Not knowing that all it takes is just them saying, okay, we done with you to look like that. And when you look like that, what man is going to then want to seek you? This is the definition of a damaged goods right here. What man is going to want that? You can give all these before pictures. No man is going to want that. You know who's going to want that? A man that's in that circumstances. And nine out of ten times, he's a he's a bottom feeder. When women supposed to be not just idolizing and honoring your body and want to show the world how good you look. Show the world how, how great of a wife you are. How you could cook. How you can... Be in your children's lives and not expose them to social media. These children nowadays are being uh, um, exposed or being infused with technology. These children, three years old, don't even know how to talk but know how to work an iPhone. You know why? Because women are so focused on doing this. Want to look good. Want to do dances, TikTok looking super stupid. Then doing what God created you to do which is give birth which is to nurture which is to comfort which is to teach allowing a man to do what he's supposed to do which is to lead protect provide but you want to follow individuals like this you want to follow the kim kardashians you want to follow all of these satanic luciferian sellouts puppets put in place to deceive you to make you look like this and never tell you about looking like that see they got the money to make sure that they never look like this they got the connections do you how much dick will you suck so you can maintain this so you can never look like this a lot of you women have destroyed your mentalness destroy your morals your principles just to keep an image so people could keep the lights coming in. When your children are suffering and you can't even keep the lights on. Trust me, man. I've been outside, man. I'm, I'm from the hood. My name used to be Pimp Game Jones. You understand? Dealt with all types of women. And all what you see on Instagram is not what you see in real life. Some of these girls... Are sleeping in basements Some of these girls are living with their friends Some of these girls are borrowing their friends clothes Sneakers Working at Walmart Wendy's But they take the time out to do this Some of these girls got four, five, six different baby daddies Some of these girls are even living in shelters man I'm telling you the truth And they just hope That a lost, ignorant No moral, principled nigga could fall for the bait and pick them up and become their sponsor so they could never look like this. But all that's about to come to an end. When this money collapse, I want to know what you're going to do. I want to know who you're going to trust. You're going to need yourself a real man. And like the scripture says, there's going to come a time where you're going to be desiring real men and they ain't nowhere to be found. And they're going to leave you with these sucker ass niggas that's going to make sure, God will make sure that the whole world see you like this instead of like that. Because you got out of order. So get right. Support the movement. Repent of that podcast. It's your brother man from the motherland. Are you dumb or are you dumb? I'm going to highlight you. Wow. Well.